Here we can discuss about how to typeset an inline equation using LaTeX. So, what is an inline equation? Let us first familiar with that term. The mathematical expression occurring in running text is called an inline equation or inline math. While considering a research article, math terms are one of the main part of the document. As per mathematics, most of the math terms are in italic font. Okay. Now let us check the codings in LaTeX. There are three syntaxes present in LaTeX for typesetting an inline equation. The first one is opening and closing symbols as dollars, and the second one is opening and closing parentheses with slash. And the last one is begin math and end math. First of all, we can typeset a simple inline math using LaTeX in Techfolio light interface. Here you can see Techfolio class file is loaded inside slash document class with A4 paper and FLEQN options. Then the begin document and the content. Here you can see quadratic equation is coded inside dollars. At last the end document. Now we can generate the PDF. Actually, LaTeX was created for typesetting mathematics very beautifully. Some special symbols are used to express some syntaxes in LaTeX. Here you can see the cap symbol is used to generate the superscript layout between x and 2. In PDF view, we can see the operator spaces around operators and relation symbols. In LaTeX, it will be automatically generated. Now, we can check some examples. The first one, opening and closing dollars, x raised to m, the multiplying symbol slash times then x rise to n equal to x rise to m plus n here the m plus n is the superscript the second opening and closing dollars parenthesis opening closing x rise to m the whole rise to n equal to x rise to m n the third one opening and closing dollars x rise to m the dividing symbol slash div then x rise to n equal to 
x rise to m minus n. The fourth one, opening and closing dollars, x rise to minus n equal to there is a fraction slash frac one is the numerator and x rise to n is the denominator the last one dollars here a square root symbol so s q r t with option n x equal to x there is another another fraction slash frac one is the numerator and n is the denominator now we can generate the pdf Here you can see the spacing around all the symbols. That's all about inline equations.